Hi guys, thanks for joining me at what is the end of XCOM 2 and I've built myself a unit of Spark robots, a squad of six. I've got the last mission here to complete, that's the Advent Network Tower. The Avatar project is at zero, so no, apart from a few random events, there's no alien activity on the map. It's all resistance, resistance, resistance maintained. Look at that. And I've opened up all the networks. Not everywhere has got a radio relay, but I've managed to take control of the whole map. So here we are. And I just thought I'd share this little mission before the main last mission so you can see the customised robot unit that I've put together. So here they are. And we'll go for a difficult one because we want the intel. Here they are, fully customised. Look at that. We've got Spark number 9, Gunnir, uh, sporting the smiley face armour. They are armed with a blaster launcher, the heavy weapon, currently a knight. Uh, we have Spark 8 Praetorium, sporting an Illyrium phase cannon and a shredder gun. He's a cavalier rank. Another cavalier here, Spark number 7 Glaive, sporting a shredder gun and Illyrium phase cannon. They've all got Illyrium phase cannons actually. Another Cavalier here, Spark number five. Oh, Glaive, we've got two called Glaive. Right, better change that. So we go to Customize, Character Info, Name. Gotta be Gloy, isn't it? There we go. Is that gonna work? Hopefully. Yeah. It's kept Glaive for some reason, I guess that's just a nickname. I'm going to put Bloy in there just to differentiate. It doesn't come up here though, which is a bit annoying. How do I change the nickname? That's a good way to do that. Let's have a look. Uh, character info, first name, ah, nickname. There we go. We'll get rid of Glaive. That's working. Then we've got Vanguard Spark Number Four Shimata, Simata. Again, armed with an Illyrium Phase Cannon and Shredder Gun. And then we've got Gawain or Gawain, Illyrium Phase Cannon equipped with Flamethrower. So four Shredder Guns, one Flamethrower, one Blaster Launcher. And off they go. They have to hack the hidden Resistance computer. And I've chosen all the colours myself. That's a fully customised unit there. It took me absolutely ages. Uh, the game should have finished a couple of days ago, but I've just kept the last mission hanging in there so I could build that unit. So we can get the full Terminator 2 experience. So I hope you enjoy it. That's all you know. Long loading time in this game, but it's always worth the wait. Exceptionally long this time. Doesn't normally take this long. Perhaps it's all the customizations I've put in. Intel suggests a hacker working for the Resistance discovered a vulnerability in the Advent Network and tried to pull some of their data from a terminal in this area. Unfortunately, the aliens were quick to eliminate the operative, but as far as we can tell, the data is critical to the aliens' latest operation. We're moving in to recover what we can. 
Eliminate all enemy contacts and secure the area. Access the network before they have time to lock down the connection. This takes absolutely ages for them to tool up and get the, the cloaking devices on. Normally you have like one spark unit in a, in a squad um, alongside the humans, but I thought it'd be fun to have a warm spark. Are they ready? Central saying something, but it's not coming through. A little bit of a glitch there. That's weird. <laughs> right, let's move it on. That hasn't happened at all in the whole of my game, so that's interesting. Now I'm recording it. He's playing up. We can't hear you, Central. Oh, I hope it's not going to do that for the whole of the thing. Right, where are we going? Straight ahead. Straight ahead, this way. And actually, these robots usually talk, so that's interesting. Oh. That's strange. I even equip them with the different languages, Spanish, French, German. So maybe that's why it's having a problem processing that. It's a real shame. I'm half tempted to start the mission again, maybe. Oh no, never mind. We'll keep going with it. It's just they are interesting characters, these robots, when they talk, so it's a shame that they're not talking. But perhaps on the next turn, the game will reset itself, we'll see. So that's my turn done. Squad moved. Central's still there bugging out. That's annoying. Yeah, I'm gonna just, I'm not gonna stop recording or anything, but I am gonna restart the level because I feel like we're not getting the full, we're not getting the full game at the moment. I'll go back to here. Hopefully it won't glitch out. Talk amongst yourselves. How was your day? What have you been up to? What have you done today to make you make you feel proud? What have you done today to make you feel proud? It's probably because I'm recording the gameplay that the PlayStation is taking a little bit longer. I'm still using a PS4. I can't afford a PS5. Um, so we've got these long load times. There we go. not there. The central's not on our screen. And the robots are still not talking. Never mind. Normally he's, they say something like advent detected. Oh, that is disappointing. 
I think it's because I've changed the language from English to German, French, Spanish. It's probably got confused. Damn, that's a real shame, isn't it? Enjoy it for what it is. Oh, it is working. Good. Scanning maximum. In fact, we need to do a little bit of healing up. This guy's got medical. So, who's the most wounded? They're all pretty bad. Gloy is pretty badly wounded. Healing up. Okay, and one more. It's between, between Gawain, Gawain and Praetorian. I think we'll go for Praetorian. <laughs> So when you have the robots speaking in English, they say an awful lot more. So it's interesting, with the French, German, Spanish translations, they haven't put all um, voice recordings in there. That's why it's so quiet and you can only hear me talking. We don't need to go on Overwatch because no one's discovered us yet. Quite a few heavies walking around. The good thing about playing robots is the snake vipers can't um, bind you up and trap you because you're you're immune to it. Oh, it's very buggy, isn't it? That shouldn't be happening. There we go. Now, are we going to stay as one unit or maybe separate a bit? Right, I think that was Spanish for Overwatch. This guy's got smiley faces all over him. I should have left some of them speaking English so you could hear, but never mind. reason Gloy can't move. I don't know what's happened there. Buzzed down completely. Maybe with all the customizations. Well, pretty quiet so far. It's all about to kick off, though. Right. Neutralize all enemy targets. Download implant connectivity audit from expressed access point. Okay, we'll give it a good go. Movimiento de largo alcance. Oh, we've been spotted. Esta 
Right. Going into overdrive for this. I still can't move. What on earth? Oh, there we go. No. Look, he's completely... Does he think he's blocked or something? Oh, dear. That's such a shame. I bet you that's to customise the name or something. So weird. Oh, he's got healing as well. Um, speaking. Right. Shots. Observe how it's done. Go in. We need you. Bewegung eingeleitet. Missed. Zielfehler. Shredder gun. Nice. Bloy still can't move, which is just unfortunate, really, but never mind. Um, I'm not sure how to deal with that, but never mind. That's never happened before. And the whole of the game, so that's weird. Oh, the intimidate works, the elite troopers panicked. Firing on his own team. And there's our objective. Five turns to get there. This guy, he can't move, so I don't know what I'm going to do with him. That could be problematic when we need to leave the area, but never mind. Look at that! Oh, how annoying. Let me just try... No, he's... I know what it is. The game thinks he's being blocked by other robots. And they're not there anymore. So what I'm going to do is just fire the shredder gun and see if that can carve a path. So the wall blown up now. Anyway, let's get on. Voy lo más rápido que puedo. Oh, lost more. El objetivo está al alcance. Commander, we have confirmation of the exposed access point. He localizado unidades de advent. Overdrive mode. So that grants three moves rather than like a, rather than one action point. You get a three, I think. I feel light on my feet. Mm -hmm. Blaster bomb. Let's do that. Such a big area here. Guard 
Drive. A bit of flame. I don't know how much effect this will have, but we'll try. A bit of flaming. Immune. It's immune to fire. Mist. Unkontrollierte Variable in Zielsequenz. Wenig Munition übrig. I don't know what that is. Some perk that they've got. Oh no. That's it bad. Oh no, he's still up. Oh, that was lucky. Missed. Menace 1 5. The advent network is almost entirely locked down. We're running out of time. Get to that terminal. Okay. Three turns to get to the terminal. I'm gonna have to make a dash for it, really. Be like this. He can move finally. God, that was so weird, wasn't it? I'm starting to get a bit worried. Um, let's just move him up. Maximum range. There we go. And from here, I can heal some of my comrades. Worth doing that. I'll heal myself. Oh no, Gawain, sorry. This guy, I, think, I love his design, the smiley faced logo. And from here, I'm going to use Overdrive. And luckily, because they're robots, they don't have to go up to the machine, they can hack from afar. Do that. Twenty-four percent chance of discovering alien alloys. No, that didn't work. But the hack, the workstation is successfully hacked. Right. Still some moves to go. We've confirmed successful acquisition of the advent files. Eliminate any remaining hostiles in the area. Okay. This unit is now reloading. Oh, why can't I see him behind a wall? That's why. Just put one overwatch then. 
Uh, let's go in for a close strike. He's not still up, is he? Yes. Unité visée à terre. Niveau critique des réserves de munitions. Oh no, <laughs> that was me thinking it was too easy. still burning. Right. Need some sort of plan here because it's about to get a bit rocky. Right, where's the medical? Medical left. Ah, no, all the medical's gone, I think. to the rescue. It's going to run through the acid though. Not great. Still up! Praetorian is going for the gatekeeper, but maybe use the shred gun. Maybe that causes more damage, but the shred gun is more likely to hit, or will guarantee a hit. Oh, there we go. lucky because that thing is lethal. Phew, that was lucky. 
not sure if he's going to last, you know. Oh, elite troopers panicked. Good. Still firing at us. Here's the mutons you've got to look out for. Uh oh. Oh, that was lucky. I would have been a goner. health left on that green one. Oh dear. Oh! Oh, he's a goner. Oh! That was the acid that they ran through. Damn. That is not a good result. I think you can repair them though. Even after they're down. Sure. Right. El movimiento al objetivo. Shield breaker left. Oh, he's low on health. And he's panicked. Moderate damage detected. longer burning from acid. Good. That's it then. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Now that would have been excellent if I hadn't lost one. Wow! Thanks for watching. So that's my squad of spark units. And I'm going to play the last mission now, probably using humans, because it makes more sense to do so. But I thought I'd show you that, and I hope you enjoyed it. And that was XCOM 2, of course, brilliant turn-based strategy game. If you haven't played it, um, I fully recommend it.
20 years of peace and prosperity will not be undone by the reckless actions of a few misguided dissidents today. We stand with the elders. Trust in their wisdom, and we shall overcome this crisis. wounded and unfortunately Gawain can't be revived. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> we'll take it anyway. So he's memorialized. And that's all you know for XCOM 2. Europe. We'll need to streamline this operation, Commander. That means sending in fewer personnel than we typically would deploy. If we're going to infiltrate the Advent Network Tower, we'll have to use a smaller squad. Try to draw less attention to ourselves than we already do. 